So I just filmed a whole bit and it wasn't recording. But at least now I know what I'm gonna talk about. I don't really like resolutions or goals for the year. I don't think that goals always reflect what we actually want from ourselves and from the year. I may have a goal that I want, you know, X amount of jobs within this year, but maybe that goal doesn't actually reflect my true desire, which is I wanna tell stories that I'm passionate about and be able to make a living off that. Those things can overlap, but maybe not. I heard somebody earlier this year talking about themes for their year instead of goals, and I really like that idea. Uh, so I'm gonna sort of carry on with that, and here is my themes that I have for this year. These are a few themes that I've had in my mind for quite a while now, but one of the big ones is being present. I have a short attention span to begin with, and that's not helped with social media or anything like that. And so I really want to be present with the things that I'm doing, whether I'm reading a book or talking to somebody or, or working. I want to be present in that moment, enjoy the process, and not be in a habit where I feel like I'm missing something on Instagram or missing a text or anything like that. Another thing that I have that's related is just being intentional there's so many times that I hop from project to project. I'm like, this one's too hard. I'm going to do this one for a while and come back to this. And I end up not getting anything done. And so I really want to spend time being intentional with something, figuring out what the problem is there, powering down on it, focusing on it, and getting it done. Breaks are good. Coming back to things with fresh eyes are good. I understand that. But I do that too liberally. Also, does it ever bother you that the people who are like, I believe in common sense, are sometimes the most frustrating people to talk to and the most close-minded people? Or is that just my experience? Another big theme that I've had in my mind is so much of what I make to me seems devoid of story. You know, a pretty landscape here or a portrait here or like a cool montage video, that's cool. But to me, I've started to realize that there's an extreme lack of story there, uh, of substance. And that's something that I really want to work on. I've been kind of been practicing in a mini way by doing um, stories on Instagram. We'll just share the process of an adventure. That's sort of like my start to trying to develop that. That's not where I want to be ultimately. I want to do longer format, but for me, sh really short format stuff helps with focusing on the, more so on the story than so the actual content. And related to that is, this one actually is more of a goal, but I do want to read more books this year. That's pretty much it. It's really brief. You know, obviously I have generic goals, like I want to make more money, I want to be healthier, all that stuff, but I think that these themes for my year um, will be good for me and in the long run impact, you know, how much of money I make, how healthy I am and all that stuff. I really appreciate you for taking the time out of your life to um, learn about me. In return, I would love to take the time to learn a little bit about your life. So if you want to share in the comments below what your themes or goals or resolutions are for this year, feel free to do so. You can also talk to me on Twitter or Instagram if you so desire. But with that, I'm out. Hope you have an absolutely fabulous rest of your your February if I don't see you, and you will see me in another video. Bye!